so for this video basically the new update just came out for Fortnite um, it's for the Christmas update and there were you know a handful of leaks a handful of things that got added in that you can already see um, but obviously I do a lot of creative and I wanted to see what else was kind of hidden away that wasn't in the leaks and there were only two things in creative that I noticed that weren't like you can't necessarily access because it's not like uh, in these it's it's it, there's a certain weapon that's not in here you can't find it you have to open it up from a chest and it's the same thing with the consumable there was a could actually never mind I lied so there is the one consumable that is new uh, which is the snowman it's not necessarily new but they redid the snowman so it is technically new um, but the other item is actually a weapon and it is a green weapon but it is not here for some reason um, the only way to do it is by opening chests so let's do a quick montage of just opening chests and I when I did this last time when I first found it it took me around thir uh, 30 to 50 chests so let's get going Also, as a side note, uh, the only time I've seen the item drop is only from regular chests. I've tried gold and I've tried blue ones on the rare occasions, and I have not seen them drop from anything else. Got it. So, this is the new weapon. It is a snowball launcher. Uh, it looks like your skins don't really matter. It has its own separate skin. Uh, so, no matter what you have on, like right now I have the, uh, here, I have, from last year, it was a, just a red skin. But on here, it doesn't affect it at all. Uh, so what it does, um, it just shoots out snowballs, as it says. Uh, it does do damage. Um, just by that right there, you can tell how much. But on other players, I have not tested it. I don't have anybody else online right now, so I can't really test that. Uh, but on yourself, it seems to only do 71 damage. So I'm assuming it's going to be the same for anybody else. So for the snowmen, uh, they basically changed them to be like the hay, the, the dumpsters, the porta potties. It's basically the same thing. You hide in them, and you can walk as them. I can't remember if that's what you were able to do beforehand, but you're able to exit them now as well. But I think the best thing about it is if you hit it, you can pick up a snowball and throw them like a grenade. The cooler thing about this is if you remember, uh, actually I can't show you right here because I'm still in a game. Uh, basically, if you had a chili grenade, um, it has the same effect. So you'd be able to freeze and move like that. Now, I can see this being a really fun way to make a map, just with like the snowmen now being added. I mean, they've always been added, but I did not know that you could do this. I'm pretty sure that it, this is a new thing that was added. If not, then I'm, I, I feel stupid. Also, as a note, it doesn't do damage. So the only other thing that has changed that I noticed 
was Caster has a new look to him. Instead of him just being uh, the normal wizard, he previously had a molten version. Now he has an ice version. Uh, so the same thing also applies to his back bling. Um, he used to have a molten one. Now it's ice. It's I, I honestly like the, the variants that they gave him since he's a wizard. But uh, the only other thing that I noticed, which Typhlosion, you're the one that always used to bring it up. Um, so the contrail <laughs> that always was seizures aren't funny, but it, the spectrum one has been changed, so it no longer is multicolored. It is just white, slightly blue, and I can see tad bit of purple coming off of it uh, so it's no longer as flashy as what it was uh, honestly it always reminded me of the rift lightning but that's just me but now it's its own separate thing and I think this is much better than what it used to be <laughs> but other than that that's the only things that I saw that were different catch you guys in the next video